Welcome back everyone to Piney Plays the Sorcerer and we are here on the ship and before we get off let's time to speak with some of the crew here. Hello there, Erian. What do you want? Uh, you're sailing with us? Of course. I'll pull my weight, unlike Jakan. He's not getting near another woman until I'm too old to stop him. And we Altmer live a very long time. Oh, yes, right. Uh, there was that little trouble with Jakarn, wasn't there? Hello there. Captain Colleen took her time getting off this damned island. Doesn't surprise me. Orc problems aren't her problems. But we'd be stuck here if not for your help. I won't forget that. You're welcome. All right. Hello, Jakarn. Uh, what do you think about Irian being here? Stros Makai is a depressing place. Too many Red Guards waving their damn swords around. At least on the spearhead, no one wants to kill me except Irian. She'll come around. She's crazy about me. Mm, yeah, okay. If you say so. Hello there. Wonderful. Now I've been ordered to follow Naramo on another fool's errand. At least the drinks are free. I guess that's something. Uh, all right. Hello. When active, Duema spiders have an extraordinary capacity for learning. Now I have to stop Andrillium from teaching Clanker to bring him drinks. <laughs> yeah. All right. That's quite a bit going on there. Anything else here? Hello? To be on the seas once again. This is paradise. Hedman Bosek is a cruel master. If Colleen will have me, I will join the Spearhead's crew. All right. There you go. Uh, any other crew that we could speak with? Hello there. I can't wait to see Jakan's battle scars. I'm sure he's got them everywhere. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah. Blade's Edge. We're setting sail with the famous Jakarn. Alethian and I have a bet on who's gonna bet him first. Okay. Well, I suggest you keep, keep away from Irian. Hello there. Wherever Captain Larissa goes, I go. Even on this tub. Can't wait until we get our own ship again. Okay, hello. How may I serve? Oh. Uh, I'll speak with you in a moment. Uh, Alright, let's see. Uh, not sure how they got up there. Is this inside? Yeah, inside. Alright, let's see. Yeah, better not steal from them. All right, let's. Ah, okay, that's how you get up there, right? Speak with them. Hello there. The spearhead's a good ship, but she's no maiden's breath. At least she'll get us away from Stros Mackay. Looking forward to getting to know Lambour better. I like an orc with a quick blade and a quicker tongue. Okay. Hi there. This should be an interesting voyage. Quite a crew Colleen has thrown together. And who are you? Vimi Lacroix. I'm a collector of sorts. One who travels to places others dare not go. I hope to join Naramo's expedition to Bizark. When I heard he had completed it and was sailing on, I just had to come along. Oh, and what do you do exactly? You're inquisitive. What I do, I do well. You'll be glad to have me on this voyage if we encounter slavers. And I make a wicked sliced ale. Right. Okay. Hi there. Again, sailors flock to the spearhead. For this, Kazan is thankful. And who are you? Master Kazan is but a humble sailor. Though others will tell you stories, some whisper the name Kassan Five Claw, Terror of the Seas. Yet yeah, these are stories for children. 
We have better things to do with our time, yes? Oh, uh, what can you tell me about the captain? Some call her the Dune Ripper's daughter, others the Forebear Witch. We, her loyal crew, call her Captain Kalin. She is a master sailor, though Kassan now wonders where her allegiance lies. Uh, what do you mean by that? There is a Forebear King in Sentinel now, Baharajad. He has allied himself with the Bretons and Orcs in this Daggerfall Covenant. Kassan fears his apprentice thinks much of Harajad. Too much. A true sea rover has no such loyalties. Ah, uh, Captain Kalin is your apprentice? Kassan taught Kalin much. Though she is her own woman, strong and proud, Kassan is grateful to help her find her way. She is a worthy successor. All that was once Kassan's is now hers. Okay. Very. All right. Yep. It's good. Okay. Well, I think that's. Oh no. I... Hello there. I'm looking forward to seeing Jakarn in action. I hear he's an incredible sailor. Lots of stamina. Oh, and uh, what made you decide to join us? Following Jakarn, of course. Why else would I be along? I'm looking forward to working alongside him, sweating shirtless in the hot sun. You wouldn't understand. Uh, all right. Okay, so I think that covers everything. Hello there. Before we leave for Betnik, talk to the crew. Get familiar with them. It'll be a long trip. I'm ready to leave now. Then we leave for Betnik, an orc island that hasn't yet joined the Covenant. I hope to change that. Lembor is happy to go home. She may try to thank you with ale. My advice? Make it to six mugs. You'll have a friend for life. Uh, right. Right now, we've made it to Bethnik, but, frankly, we have unresolved business down at Daggerfall, and I think it's high time that we went and took care of that. How may I serve? Hey, can you arrange passage for me? It depends where you need to go. This is a working ship. We don't traverse all of Tamriel Seas. Okay, where do you sail? Hmm. From here, we travel to Stros Mackay. A bit tricky, but we should be able to make it before the weather changes. Uh, or you could head into Daggerfall. You shall find there everything you need, and then some. There have been a few storms along the way, but nothing we can't handle. Let us pray our charts are current. All right, let's go to Daggerfall then. All right, we are now in Daggerfall, and it's time for us to save this king that we have. Unable to save the last time we were here. So let's see. First thing. Huh. Hopefully that helps. Yeah, okay. Well, all right. Now we've got a little help for whatever we do. And let's see. Some skills. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. I might be able to do. S well. Okay. Wall of Elements? I don't think I've got an appropriate staff to use that with, right? Let's see. Yeah. Well, I still don't have a perfect weapon, unfortunately. Just wasn't getting them quite well, but I guess using a healing staff. These is better than nothing. All right, let's see. All right, let's get up here and find the castle and take care of this and be done with it. There you are. Do not panic. Only you can see me. Come, we have to talk. Uh, what is it? There you are, Vestige. We must speak at once. Oh, hello, Prophet. Listen well. I have located a safe harbor from which we might plan our course of action. You must meet me there. Uh, where is the safe harbor? I awoke in a city of Bretons. 
its air heavy with the smells of baked bread, horses, and intrigue. Daggerfall. Uh, that's where the I'm at now. is in an abandoned cave outside the city. Right, I'll find it. Yeah, right. Well, maybe not find it, because right now I am more interested in finding Castle Daggerfall. Uh, which is way... Oh, I didn't realize it was that far away. But we will keep on going. As far as we can get. Myself most likely in order to get here and honor and steal. All right, now let's see if I can successfully save the king. Well, survive the battle might even be a better idea. All right, let's see. One clan fear with me. One. That's that. That should do actually. Okay. Done. Uh, those two are destructive things, which are going to be completely useless. Okay, fine. Well, we'll see what I can do. All right, now I've entered there. Now I must find the king. And aha, as I thought, my mayor disappeared. So, bring him in. My lord, you must go now. I will not. The dragon does not flee its lair. They're coming for you. Wait, what was that? Death to the king. Death to the king! Get the king out of here, go! Upstairs. Right. Uh, if I find the right, right way upstairs. Okay. I got lost. Ah, oh, the stairways are this way. Okay. I think I have to go upstairs in order to complete this. lost my clan fear that I can take care of and probably also want to eat something before I go what am I fighting now oh probably my familiar going on starting battles already no one will stand in Angoff's yeah. way Where are they all coming from? Hey, hey, don't do that to me. Come on, hey, do something, do something. Ah. Oh, another one? Good grief. Good grief. All right, now. Let's see, can't I have anything I can eat to help me with this quest? Probably that'll be under consumables. Stamina recovery. Oh yeah, that's really useless. Oh well. Yeah. I mean, really you have to fight an army in order to get through all these guys. <sighs> so how do you do this? No one will stand in Angoth's way. And I can't move. Oh, good. 
great. Good riddance. Oh, now I get a destruction staff. <laughs> uh. Captain, this isn't easy for me to say, but I want to apologize for ignoring your well, warnings. Well, I, I guess I did have... It was nothing, my kid. A couple of those. I apologize if I was impertinent in my duty. Not at all, Arison. Rise, please. In service to Daggerfall, our friend here is to have any support the Watch or the Knights can provide. Of course. We'll do whatever we can to help find Angoff and determine his motives. All of Daggerfall stands behind our hero. It would seem that the captain's concern for me was well founded. You save me from this assassin's blade, as well as from my own foolishness this day. I did what I could. Indeed. The body on my floor proves that. Who was this man who came to kill me? What did he want? Uh, an assassin named Varric, uh, but he worked for someone called Angolf. Angolf? I've heard this name whispered by my agents. The royal spymaster reports of unrest across my kingdom, stirred into a froth by this Angolf. But that's all we know. He wanted to create chaos by assassinating you. Creating chaos is a method, not a goal. It's a means, not an end. There's more going on here than chaos for its own sake. We must get to the bottom of this. Anything I can do? Oh yes, my friend. I hereby grant you special dispensation to investigate the villain Angoff in my name. But you must keep this quiet, for we don't want to tip our hand. I shall never forget your service this day, however. All right. Okay, so that takes care of that. Angoff, I believe, is the villain in the werewolf quest line. So he's involved in that. So that's what goes in there. But that did give me a skill point and all sorts of fun stuff for that. Well, that I think is where we would. Well, elements to rank three. Did I ever actually use that? I think it's because I have all these level four cheap things that I've been using, but I really should have switched to one of those. Because now I've got one of each of the three. Never even used my destructive staffs stay for anything. Oh well. So much for that. Well, I think this is where we'll conclude this series. Finally saving the king. Sounds like a good as place as any. So when actually maybe we could at least do anything useful in any of these books all right but before we go if you are willing to listen to a little bit of lore but we will read of the mayor of Pyandonia and finish off there entry 543 atlas notes imperial geographical society it was once believed that the mayor of Pyandonia were originally exiles of the Somerset Isles but while it is likely they came from similar Altmeri ancestors, they certainly did not come from Somerset. Translations of tapestries of the Crystal Tower tell of the tale of a far older separation. The Mammer likely differentiated from their ancestral Altmeri not in Somerset, but in their original homeland of Altmeris. Orgnum, their leader and self-styled king, according to the legend, was a phenomenally wealthy Altmeri nobleman who used his fortune to finance a rebellion against the powers of the land. He and his followers were banished for this to a place that separated the Altmeris by an impenetrable mist. Pandania, the mist-veiled isles. This exile proved so effective that the followers of Orgnum never again disturbed their former countrymen. The new Aldmeri homeland of Somerset, however, was not so lucky. For much of Somerset's history, the Mayormer have launched attacks against the cousins of old Elfenfey. They, every one of these battles has been led by Orgnum himself 
who it seems is not only immortal, but grows more youthful by the century. No historian, to the knowledge of the staff of the Imperial Geographic Society, has counted the number of wars and stratagems employed against Somerset, but somehow each has proved, no matter how ingenious, an ultimate failure. One attack in particular is worthy of mention, as it gives us the only glimpse into the actual landscape of Pyandonia. In the year 2nd era 486, a small Mer Mary fleet was sighted off the coast of Alinor, and King Hidalith ordered his navy to give chase. The navy followed with the ships through the uncharted waters into an ambush near Pyadonia itself. Most of the Alp Mary navy was destroyed but a single warship returned to Somerset to describe the land as a sea jungle. Massive plateaus spilling over the vegetation form mazes around the valleys of ocean. Waving tendrils of kelp trap all but the mammers on ships and provide a well-camouflaged home for the sea serpents that are Orgnum's guards and occasional mounts. Mist storms spill over the land, further disoriented their views. That even one ship survived the visit is a testament to the maritime genius of the Altmer. Oh, now I remember who the Ma now I remember who the Marimer are. Yes, of course, they are the opponents you have when you are down in your original areas, when you're in the Elflands. Of course, the Marimer. I completely forgot about the Sea Elves in that matter. But that is it for our series this time, so well, I'll see you again for another series on some other game in the near future. And this is Pine Leaf Needles reminding you to quest responsibly.